Hello to my viewers. This is Maths for Grade 5. The topic is changing the similar fractions to similar fractions. I have here number 1, 3 over 5. And then I have 1 third. And the last is 4 over 9. So first thing to do is we have to find the LCD between 5, 3, and 9. So what will be our LCD? LCD... I will give you an overview of LCD. LCD is least common denominator. Okay? So LCD between 5, 3, and 9 is 45. So this one will be the first fraction and then Another one is the second fraction, and this will be the last fraction, which is 4 over 9. So LCD is 45. So we need to divide LCD by the first denominator, second denominator, third denominator, and then multiply the numerators. So 45 divided by 5, that is 9 times 3, 27. Okay? Next is 45 divided by 3, that is 15. Times 1, so 15. Next is 45 divided by 9, that is 5, times 4, 20. So I have here similar fractions. So I have 27 over 45, 15 over 45, and then 20 over 45. So all the denominators are the same, which is 45. Now let's go to number 2. Again, we have to find the LCD of 7, 5, and 10. So what will be the LCD between that numbers? So, first, I need to reduce this one. So I will divide by 4 in order to reduce. This will be divide by 2. So 4 divided by 2, this will be 2. Then 10 divided by 2 is 5. So, my new fraction now is 2 over 5. Okay. To make it easy, I have two denominators of 5 and 1, 7. So, I'll just multiply this one. This will be 35. So, 35. 35. Okay. 35 divided by 7, that is 5 times 4. 20. Then how about the second fraction? 35 divided by 5. That is 7 times 4. 28. Next is the last fraction. 35 divided by 5. That is 7 times 2. 14. So I have now the similar fractions. 20 over 35, 28 over 35, and 14 over 35. Now let's proceed to number 3. Number 3, I have 1 over 2, 1 over 3, 1 over 4, and the last fraction is 1 over 5. Okay, arrange this one and make a similar fraction. So 1, uh, 2, 3, 4, 5. So let's say this is 30. Can we divide 30 by 2? Yes. 30 divided by 3, that is 10. 30 can be divided by 4. I think it cannot be divided because there is a decimal. Can be divided. Now, what will we do? Find another LCD. Let's say 60. 60 divided by 2. Okay. This can be divided by 2. This can be divided by 3 can be divided by 4, can be divided by 5. So therefore, my LCD for the three frac 4 fractions sorry, is 60. This will be 60, 60, and the last will be 60 also. 60 divided by 2, that is 30. 60 divided by 3, that is 20 times 1, 20. 
60 divided by 4, 15 times 1, 15. 60 divided by 5, that is 12 times 1. So I have here 12 over 60. So the new fraction for number 3, the equivalent fraction for number 2 is 30 over 60, num one third. This will be 20 over 60. The third fraction, 15 over 60, and the last fraction will be 12 over 60. So, these are the similar fraction. Now, let's go to number 4. 5 over 16. And then 1 over 4. And then 3 over 8. So, I will make this one a similar fraction. So, I think the LCD is 16. 16, 16, okay, 16 divided by 16, that is 1, times 5, so I've got 5 in the numerator, 16 divided by 4 is equal to 4 times 1, 4, then the last will be 16 divided by 8, that is equal to 2, times 3, so I have 6 over 16, so the, um, the similar fraction are 5 over 16 for 5, 16, then for 1 over 4 is 4 over 16 and the last will be 6 over 16. Now the last example which is number 5. Number 5, I have here 7 over 9, 2 over 3, 1 over 4 and the last is 3 over 6. So I need to find the LCD between 9, 3, 4 and 6. So, can we divide the 4 denominator? So, I think we can use 36. So, this will be 36. Same, 36. And the last also 36. Okay. To find the numerator, we need to divide from 36 by 9. So, 36 divided by 9. That is 4. And then, multiply by the numerator, which is 7. So, this will be equal to 28. So, my numerator for the first fraction is 28. Now, the second fraction, 36 divided by 3. Okay, 36 divided by 3. So, 6 divided by 3, that is 2. Then, 3 divided by 3, that is 1. Then, multiply the numerator, which is 2. So, I have here, for the second fraction, in the numerator will be 24. Then, the third so, 36 divided by 4, that will be equal to 9, and then multiply by 1. So, this will be equal to 9. So, my third fraction will be 9 over 36. Then, how about the last fraction? So, 36 divided by 6 is equal to 36, and then multiply by the numerator, which is, sorry, this is 6, I mean. 36 divided by 6 is 6. Times the numerator is 3. So, 6 times 3 is 18. So, this is 18. So, my new fractions in number 5, I have 28 over 36, 24 over 36, 9 over 36, and 18 over 36. So, this all for the changing the similar fraction to similar fractions.